I want to be a medical doctor when I grow up. I want to be a scientist when I grow up. I want to be a missionary when I grow up. I want to be a graphic designer when I grow up. Africa's working age population is set to increase from 370 million adults to over 600 million within the next decade. By 2030, over half a billion jobs will be lost to artificial intelligence, robotics, and job automations. The UN and the World Economic Forum believe higher skills will be demanded, especially digital skills. Educational systems will have to adapt and equip children who are the future workforce with digital skills like social media analytics, coding, web, and app development. In Nigeria, STEM and digital education have been deployed, but there are challenges. It is, however, unfortunate that technology and innovation has not completely seeped through into the rural areas of the country. A year ago, we had some kids visit us from three rural schools in Abuja. This was part of our initiative to synthesize kids on the relevance of technology in education. There were a group of boys that wanted to visit space in the future, and there were a group of girls that wanted to be engineers. Access to relevant technology programs in this school have done wonders for these kids. From my interaction with the kids, I asked them whether they had access to mobile phones and whether they had access to computers. None of them did. From my interaction with the teachers, I also got to discover that they didn't have access to internet connectivity and electricity in these schools. We don't have computer system here. Even lights, we don't have lights. As you are seeing yesterday, they cut the line. We were burdened as a hub and we were challenged from our encounter with these kids. And we came to the realization that even though technology has evolve and is integrating into the lives of Nigerians. There was still a gap between those who live in the city and those who live in rural areas. We believe schools should be technology hubs to bridge the digital divide, especially for millions of kids who do not have access to technology. Therefore, we created the project Civic X. Civic X is a mobile lab equipped with TV screens, internet access and educational programs installed on educational tablets to bridge the digital gap between rural and urban areas. Today we are at the Melchizedek Academy and we are starting their training today. So come with me. Teaching kids digital skills is not necessarily to nudge them towards a degree in computer science or engineering but to prepare them for a future where these skills will be relevant and applicable. As you can see, the children, they are learning. If you want to now remove it, you just swipe it up and it will go. Technology is very important to people who are learning, just like the students that we have here. We are passionate about educating and creating awareness about the need for digital literacy in rural areas. As a whole, we've been focusing majorly in promoting the UN Sustainable Development Goals and our project Civic X centers on Goal 4 and 10. So we aim to improve the quality of education and also bridge the gap between technology in rural areas and other areas.